When you're ready, sir. Good morning, Hickory Sunrise. Good, Good morning, morning, sir. Pledge of allegiance, please. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. No, Michael. Dear Lord, thank you for this day. Thank you for the reminder that it's still your world, your control, our blessings. We thank you for Rotary, thank you for this fellowship, and we ask you to watch over us as we prepare to run uh, our spring fundraiser, make it a success, Father, and let us do the best we can with the proceeds. Be with us now as we finish these plans, we ask in your son's name. Good morning, Rosarians. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Everybody's good morning. this morning. Uh, good afternoon. How are you? Go ahead and bring your get your doll out. We'll take the archives. All right. A couple of announcements. We just started. Richard, you yes. have a guest. This I do. Morning. I do. Stand and introduce our guest. My guest this morning is Chris Mundy. And he's graciously decided to come to be my guest today at Rotary. So welcome Good. to Thank you. Okay. okay. A little bit of confusion here, but I've got to get it straightened out. And Ron Lee probably can answer this, and I get confused. Uh, tell me, Ron, your responsibility on the bulletin. Where does it fall? Uh, page. Uh, one and two and the bottom of page three. Okay, what about the back page? Who's responsible for that? Uh, somewhere between uh, the secretary and the secretary. Okay. <laughs> secretary, yes. We still have members. Tracy Reese is no longer in our club. Is that correct? Say yes. Mark Tiffin. Yes. 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 I got we have discontinued her, but she has not said she she can't be reached. She I need her to say I want to drop because I right. can't pull her membership without that. Mark, you just I got wait. Michael. Okay. Thank you. All right, good deal. All right, Mark Pittman. He has not indicated he wants out yet either. I'm going to confirm that with him. Okay. Now you are still sending emails out to them. I am. And it still has it. It's still the idea is to is to, to try to light them back up. Okay, so we'll give you a, a, a waiver on this to get this straightened out. But I will take your one dollar while you're working on it. Okay. <laughs> well, All right. That's good. I'm right? glad to see you this morning. Yes, I'm doing great. All right. This is where the confusion comes in. Sir, your memory's gone. That buck you just took was for Michael coming in late. This is my No. Oh, well, that's great. All right, we got Michael. We've got some pen you're using something you find. It's unbelievable. All right. Dan, I need a clarification. Okay. I'm a little bit confused on this, but I need a clarification. All right. How close does a comment have to be correct <laughs> to be in the legal profession to be counted as acceptable? Or how close are the facts to be counted correct in the legal profession? It's either exactly right or it's wrong. It's either right or wrong. All right? Now, the question is this. Rick gave you an honor that was bestowed on you, but too early. If you remember that, would that be correct or would that be wrong? I think he made a mistake in what he was saying in recognition of you going to Charlotte. Yeah, I, I did get the award in Charlotte. I'll be getting it and will be. Right. You. It's a citizen's award. It's a citizen's lawyer. Okay. Yeah. All right. Now, how did Rick present that? Well, I think I said a community service award. <laughs> yeah. All right. But I think I, I heard... I, 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 okay, any confusion, Gavin made an announcement on this for us and got our attention, and I will put one dollar in there if I created any confusion, I never have, 
But I won't. <laughs> 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 All right. Yeah. 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 Yeah
That's right. Can't be Donald right. and can't be right here because we're in Greensboro. That's right. That's right. I don't think I can do it. Then. I think I can do it. Okay. I'll do it. Okay. I'll who, who is the other person for the soup kitchen? Uh, I can find out. Hang on. They're just, they're just one. You know, I'm, I'm sort of the permanent second Friday guy. Okay. And I, it's my responsibility to get somebody to do it if I can't make it. Okay. So we're, we're good. So Gavin's going to take it? Um, no, I don't think I can. No, oh, Kenny. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, thank you. So far, I just can't. He, although he, he's a single. I, although I, I will probably check just to be sure. That's what I'm asking. Um, if the, uh, the I, I dropped in at the soup kitchen Monday, and um, because of all the snow, they had uh, had some trouble with volunteers, but but we got through it okay, and it was. Um, was slightly attended because the Salvation Army uh, let all the people stay in all day. Mm -hmm. all the stores. Just for the, I missed the first part of that. When is the soup kitchen thing? Friday. Friday. This, this, this Friday. Friday. Last Friday was the second Friday. Yeah, that was. Ron has a separate obligation that he's asking for help with. He, he is a permanent. So you're asking for help this week. It's not might, necessary. You might be right. Let me check what Austin. I might have. Well, the schedule is March 9th. That's the second Friday. And that was to be Jim Starkey and Bob Sagan. Oh, yeah? I thought we had checked. So we're, we're, we're not that. doing it officially at so, Sunshine Road Reading. Okay, that's off. Yeah. Gotcha. So you're just a permanent one looking for help all the time. Gotcha. <laughs> when I can't be there. When you, when you can't be there. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Anything else before we crank up on the dams? Yes. Can I make mention of the well, face of a child program? I have got some pictures for the face of the child. However, they didn't send me enough. They only sent me half enough. So rather than bringing the half that I had, I thought I'd wait and bring them all together. So hopefully, maybe maybe even next week, I may have the pictures of the face of the child. Well, one for everybody. I'm in a book. Uh, 20, how many is in our club? 25, 22? So I'm going I'm to bring those. I'm, hopefully, I'll bring the pictures next week. I can't promise that because I'm waiting for them to come in today. Okay. All right. Thank you. Bob Steiger. Yes, sir. Would you guide this ship through the troubled waters of the area? Yep. Sure. Oh, sorry. Before we start, Kenny, please sir. introduce your guest. This is my favorite son, Seth Clons. <laughs> He's also the one that's on a two-hour delay this morning. That's right. That we, didn't, that, that we didn't realize about until... Until uh, about two hours. Yeah. <laughs> so who's the one that's not favorite? Y'all never met him. No. <laughs> neither, neither has Seth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, okay. Okay, first of all, uh, I need a show of hands people that have not told me they have tables reserved. People who have I'm not told you have I, one? No, I don't have you one. Don't have I don't one. have enough people. <laughs> you don't have one, Jim? Okay. I don't have enough people. i got six people. That's it. Okay. You want me to put your table together anyway? Yeah. We'll, we'll see what we can pull up. Use it as With McKellen, I don't know how many he has. It's been a tough, tough sell. How's he thing. doing, by the way? He's running hard. Yeah, he switched jobs. He's in... Um, yeah, in okay. Alabama today or something like that. So it looks like we have uh, three, four, five, six, Rick, you said two tables, correct? Uh -huh. 21 tables. Ooh, okay. Great. They'll be light, they won't be full, they won't be packed, but I, my, my, uh, my thought process was to at least fill the room with, with lots of tables and make it look like there was people at, at every table. And, We've got District Rotary coming. Uh, Rob, Bob's bringing some dignitaries, and uh, we have a <clears throat> special guest coming. Um, he's going to be uh, singing for us, oh, wow. and then the next day he appears on national TV. Oh, cool! Is there any way we can publicize that? Not sure. I don't think so. 
Right. Alan said we need to keep it low key because you know he's owned by American Idol. Okay. So he is going to sing at least two songs for us. He may we may coerce him into getting up on stage and, and, and singing with the band. Um, what day is he going to be on Sunday? He'll be on Sunday at 8 o'clock. He gets the story, the whole nine yards told, and then he gets to present before the judges. Of course, we know uh, what happens in front of the judges. He is in the top 40. He will not have to go back to Hollywood until he makes it to the top 10, which we hope he does. Um, I thought maybe if we, Alan's going to get up and say something about uh, Johnny White, and uh, give him his background and where he's headed, and maybe ask, just gonna put a bucket down or something to see if the crowd wants to get five and ten dollars, that type of thing, because he really doesn't have money to, to make it the rest of the trip. So, excited about that. He's going to sit uh, beside the band with uh, two tables that I got reserved for the DJs that are coming from WSGE and, and one other radio station, and the band will be sitting at that table, and hopefully, he'll get some, some interaction with those folks. Uh, District Rotary has got their own table, and uh, make sure you stop by and thank them for coming. Oh, and they're going to give us our banner whenever we say we Very have good. it on the calendar, we'll the schedule. Okay. Rick's going to MC the event from start to finish. I guess we'll do the 50-50? Yes, we'll do the 50-50. And Mike and I will be there okay. to, to collect money once again. Okay. Uh, uh, so I thought maybe uh, we should talk about real quick taking the 50-50 and giving it to Johnny White for expenses. Give it to him for traveling expenses or whatever. He wants to allocate 50-50 proceeds. Thanks a great idea. I'll, I'll entertain a motion for that. Okay. Bob's was a motion, I'll second it. So we have a motion on the floor then to take the 50-50 proceeds and give them to Johnny for traveling expenses for the American Idol program. Any discussion on that? Call the question then all those in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Aye. Motion carries. Okay. What are we doing with that meal? The meal is a combination of corned beef uh, slash beef some sort of pie. It's not a shepherd's pie, but it's, it's a pie of some mm -hmm. kind. It's um, Irish bangers, whatever that is. I think that's a oh, sausage. Sausage. Roasted chicken, mashed potatoes. Wow. See? And all for $7.50. Aren't bangers potatoes? Yeah, but no, some some sort of sausages. Sausages. Well, not specifically Irish, but they... Bangers and mashed. What kind of veggies? Mashed potatoes. <laughs> uh, uh, any, any mashed potato you want. Uh, Roasted roots. Count 250 times 750. That, correct. 250 times 750. Yeah, by the time we have the help in the room, then I'm sure we'll be over 200. So, um, with that being said, I, I reviewed our contract with the band a couple of nights ago and found out that they start playing at seven o'clock. Oh, wow. Which is an hour early. Mm -hmm. 7 to 11, we've got the band for four hours. Okay, and we negotiated that down to $3,000, so thank goodness for that. Good. Um, my big concern at this point is the Richard has taken the lead uh, in Robert's absence with uh, the handling of the food, and more importantly, how many Rotarians we have available, because I keep getting niched by one. And so I don't know how many we're down to. I think we're down to maybe just a handful of Rotarians that are going to help for the dance. So let's let's go through the events before the dance. Sure. Friday. Does it start Friday? No set up on Friday. No set up on no, Friday. Got to all be Saturday morning. All right, Saturday morning. So what time do things start Saturday morning? Nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. Do you, do you have any notion who's going to be there to help you set up? I know Kenny's going to be there. Ron's going to be there. Uh, Richard. Robert, well, you see the hands going up. So okay. we've got plenty for set up for the room. Okay. I think the issue on. is I haven't heard from the whether the uh, folks from Rotaract are going to help us serve or not. Donald was going to handle that. I, I have not heard either way. So let's assume at this point we've got to serve. Okay, but well, before we get to serve, the next thing that has to happen is after the room is set up, is is food delivery, is that right? Yes. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm a, with, with uh, Austin's going to let us use his van 
to pick up the food at Market on Main and, and to bring it over to uh, Brett's. And so there's why we're going to need some help getting it from the van into the place. What time? Oh, no, what time? Yeah. Well, when the food needs to be on the table, ready to serve at 6.15. Yeah. So it's probably going to be, I'm going to try to pick it up somewhere around 4, 4.30, something at, like at that. At Market on Main? At Market on Main. Okay. Loading up, they have help for you, right? Or we don't know that. Both. At, the, at Market on Main, there is no help. Gene's he's going to help me get it loaded. Okay. I'll need help. And then, right. But I'll need the help getting it from the van inside and setting it up. What time are you going to be with? So well, I'm, I'm probably about five, I'm guessing. That okay, but you won't need that much help at Market on Main? No. Okay. Just loading help. He's down to one chef, so John's going to be in Cuba. Um, he leaves Thursday morning, but most of the food's already been prepped. Richard and I and whoever else wants to join us is going to, are going to meet with John Duke today about 2.30 just to finalize little things like ice and, and uh, <laughs> little things we seem to forget. Uh, Utensils. Shaving can, can you going to bring cups? I got cups. I, I've got to get plates and I've got to get uh, ice if, if he don't Star have any. And, yeah. and ask him about the story. I talked to Austin yesterday. He's pretty sick. He was going to be at a meeting this morning, but we'll have to talk to him via phone and see if we can get the chafing dishes and things like that ahead of time because he's going to the he's got basketball all that tournament. Say. Yeah, so yeah. he won't be with us either. Yeah, Austin and I are planning on doing the pickup Monday morning okay. to get the stuff out of there over to Market on Main and cleaned up. Um, question about the food. Uh, last time we had so much left over, we had to take it over to the. I mean, we had <coughs> tons of it left over. I think we're going to see if Val wanted to take it. Uh, yes, he'll he'll uh, uh, give it to the cops. Yeah, <laughs> give it to the cops. Yeah, yeah. So we may be doing a uh, a run over to the police station. Well, he'll be there on site anyway with us, so he'll just make a couple phone calls. Yeah, the food they they come over, in their so. cars and get it. Yeah. Did last time. Yeah. As long as we get the pants back. Didn't we take it over? No, we took it over in the truck. Did we? Yeah, we, uh, we hauled it over in the truck. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm talking a lot of food. A lot of food. A lot of food. Because we haven't said anything about the food yet. I'm good. Okay. Okay. I didn't know whether you had those. <coughs> so. <laughs> are confused. Okay, okay so, so now we've got the food at, at the... Uh, at, at the mill, and we're set up, and now the next thing that happened, Bobby and Phil will be selling 50-50 tickets okay. to, um, to, to to put the money in for the American Idol project. I think we're um, surprising with that, by the way. Okay, we'll keep our mouths shut. Um, uh, tickets downstairs, we need somebody downstairs. Correct. Get down. Yeah, okay, money. I have a lot of envelopes, or I have eight or ten envelopes that the people owe money for. Yeah. There's no raffle going on this time downstairs, is that correct? Oh, correct. Okay. So your job downstairs is only to, to manage the, the people coming in and their tickets. That's right, coming in and handling the tickets, coming in, and if there's an envelope there, that says that person needs yeah. two tickets, I'll handle that. But I need someone with me. We had a few we gave away. We gave WSGE six tickets, and she she forwarded me via email yesterday the uh, recipients of those tickets. So we gave them six tickets, and they would advertise the dance for us. It it looks like it's going to be at least pretty chilly, um, so we may want to consider coat check. People people tend to ask us at fifty fifty about coat check, and we've got that room behind us. Um, Need hangers. Yeah, we need, we'll need some, I, I think I can round up hangers. Do we need to do any kind of a receipt, code check receipt? I think so. Yeah, I'm going to hang them up in there. Okay, all right. Got me a the last time. Is it true? Oh, um, is, it, is it warm? Donald and Steve, with them we're going to follow up about rotor rack and about security, right? Security's handled. Yeah. It is handled. Yes. Richard and Doc? Yeah. Have talked to him? I talked to him. Okay. Yeah. Okay. He's going to be good. Yeah. I was worried for a minute. You said Richard, Doc, they're going to do the security. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. Yeah, that would be okay, too. Yeah. He's pretty mean with a drill. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. Rich, Rich will bring his bow and uh, mm -hmm. and other ceremonial accoutrements, and we'll be all set. Okay, so now we're ready to start the dance and feed people. So what time? What time? What what, what time do people show up? What time do we feed them? My suggestion is, is the food is ready, they should be able to eat. Yeah, yes, absolutely. Right. As soon as the, the food is ready, they, they can eat. I'd if say the, 6.30. If the food committee yeah. does their job and we're ready to roll at 6 o'clock, let's say, as they come in the yeah. door, yeah. Uh, yeah. let them eat. Yeah. And uh, maybe all hands on deck by 5.30, quarter to 6 at the latest. Okay. Okay. Eat it. We can do it. Rick will start to show the off. The um, food on your stomach. He'll just add that we've done it enough now. I, we I, can, I can do that. What about Johnny B? Is he going to be there? He is. Uh, we're going to try to put Johnny B on but, but right after the first set okay. of the band. Good. Okay. Set's 45 minutes? I hope so. Yeah. Yeah. And so Johnny White would come in at that time too? Uh, I'm sorry, I meant Johnny. Johnny okay. White. Yes. okay, let's go back to Johnny B. Yes. Johnny B, the yeah. DJ. Johnny B and the other DJ that we have for our dancers are okay. both coming. They cool. are used to starting at 7 and going from 7 to 8. Um, <clears throat> they can go earlier. Correct. And I can leave the emceeing to a minimum. Yeah. Whatever. I'll talk to him about what he wants. I'm going to call so Johnny to that. 6.30 yeah. to yes. 7. Put him on half Probably a good idea. Johnny goes 6.30 to 7. Yeah, he, he may go earlier. He, he can play music during the break. Yeah. Okay. That's fine. How long do Johnny White have that first break? Correct. Okay. The break's going to yes. be 15 minutes? Uh, their break's usually 20, yeah. 25 minutes. Uh, that'll be enough for Johnny to, uh, <coughs> Alan said he'll see if he can get him to uh, sing a couple of songs for us back to back. Does he need music? Uh, he has his own. He'll just plug it into the system. And, Unless they've got something a little better, we'll just add it as, as, as a break into it. They're supposed to arrive early. So their second set will run roughly from 8.15 to 9 p.m. I'm sorry? Their second set? Uh, roughly. Yeah, to 9 to 9.30? Uh, <clears throat> yeah. Okay. Then 9.30 to 10.15. And then maybe 10.30 to I'm out of here at 11. Okay. So when are we going to do the banner presentation? Oh, yeah, the banner presentation. Prior to Johnny. Yeah. I wouldn't do it afterwards. I'd do it. I can ask the band to take an extended break. Yeah. First break. I don't know how much the crowd will like that, but well, so the first banner break. presentation should go pretty quickly. Yeah, first break. Yeah, that's no more better than a couple minutes. Okay. All right. If Johnny sings two songs, that's six, seven minutes. The crowd's going to like that. Yeah, yeah, that'll, that'll keep them there. And we can tease them by saying, the following, you know, Johnny White's coming up, Johnny White's coming up, whatever, they can do the rotary presentation and then uh, bring Johnny on stage. For those that don't know Johnny in the crowd, we're not going to say anything until he sh just appears on stage. And what I think cover, Alan Finley will take the mic from you and, okay. and, and do that at that point. Question about the 50 50. If we're going to give that to Johnny and we say we're not going to tell anybody, when you you and Bobby are sort of sitting there saying, you know, give money to the 50 50, should they know what is going on? I think, I think what we'll tell do, Johnny. I think what we'll do, oh, well, we can't really tell the folks coming in. I think what we're going to do, and, and I'm, I'm just mulling this over, is we'll say we have a special. A special something situation that we're collecting the money for. How many people really care where the other half goes? That, that, yeah, really. that you'll hear about at the first break. Yeah. 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 You're right. Yeah. It's the other half. Yeah. As long yeah. as whoever They're wins it gets his or her half. half. That's right. all they care about. Of course. And we can, but it's a good idea to yeah. say and thank you because what you do with the other half goes right. right. Yeah. You may put it on the side of the building. This is one for a special recipient. Special recipient. Tonight. Tonight. Yeah. There. Perfect. Yeah. 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 There you go. Well, what if he doesn't show me? <laughs> <laughs> and then it goes to me. Yeah. <laughs> it goes to the MC. It's still a special oh, <laughs> Richard, we need to remember trash cans and liners from the soup kitchen. Good. Just talk about that. Because that's where we get them from? Yes. Yep. Yep. Yes. Yeah, we need to have a garbage detail, one or two or three people that'll do that. I wrote it down. Throughout Thank the you. evening. Thank you, Gene. Yes, sir.
I'll have a money box with seat money too for you. Okay. By the way. Yep. Stay and a money box for you. Yep. Seat money. So whenever we have present at the dance, we'll have eight to ten to twelve, 12 people. We'll have changes. Have That's to what I'm saying. Change. Twelve. With what we have to work with. We change up at the end. Is for cash. Yeah. Critical. Yeah. And Everybody's I'll be there with the one. And, I'm, and I've got to leave early. Good. We did have one of these last time. So. Good. Yeah. We'll just need to. We'll need to arrange with the um, folks at the mill where we can put the food stuff that Austin and I need to pick up Monday morning, where they want us. Last time, on that back deck. Last time we just sort of made up an area on the back deck, but yeah. you and I should remember when we get there, talk to the mill Confirm. first and say we're going to need to stack up chafing dishes and that sort of stuff. Yeah, we did that last time. We did, down yeah. on the deck, just yeah. on the, on the okay. loading dock. We just to make sure we're there okay with that. Okay, Kenny, you're all good with the printing. You've got all you need. Yes. Okay, you, you, you need to get these table poppers. Did you catch my email yesterday? Yes. Okay. You're in Donald's hostage. We need to get up at Donald because I did not receive any. I got a check, but no, no, like, Send me his name. Can you email me his name? Uh -huh. I'll just pull up his information for the door call. To I forward what Donald. I don't know who I got. I saw that this morning came through from Donald. I want to make sure his guy got. Oh, it did. Yeah. Yeah. I want to make make sure his person got counted. I got the check. It's paid. I just don't have any art or anything. Pull that up his website or whatever. And I'll it was just a winging business card. Rick, you got anything else that you? Want to yeah, I think I think we're covered. Um, <laughs> and and just so everybody understands, everybody has made a great effort on this. All right. Uh, the difference, the, the primary difference between this one and other dances is that crowd from Morganton is going somewhere else on that day. We've always depended on 50 to 60 so, yeah. of those folks showing up, uh, and they'll be there for um, Halloween. So, yeah, we're okay. Yeah. I, I think we're above break even at this point, if my calculation is correct. Uh, G's going to give us a next week rolling number next week. And this is one we this is the one we play with anyway because you know we moved to different places. Yeah, yeah. The, the, part for yeah. the next one, I, I, don't, I don't see a need to even talk about it. Yeah, we'll knock it out of the park on the. Uh, that'll be a full park. capacity crowd. Yeah. Yeah. I sent out the, I sent another email yesterday telling people there were still some tickets left. Okay, and I boosted it on Facebook. Um, you saw that? I spent ten dollars and boosted yeah. it to twenty thousand people. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, we don't have that many. <laughs> <laughs> God, but we can print some, can't we? Yeah. <laughs> uh, Glenn's going to give him that chance today. Okay, so yeah, I feel I need you or Dan to sign it. Camp Corral. Camp Corral. Okay, we got time to go today. Yeah, I think that is. Camp Corral. Two, if you don't mind, sir. Can we get the press there? Uh, I'm working on the press today. You talk about for the for the yeah. yes. I'll also yeah. need to work on the press today. I'm gonna call Rob Reed. Two o'clock at Old Corral. Yes. For Ed Goldbrown. I won't be on the right now. I think Bob our okay. Halloween okay. dance will be the twenty seventh. Yeah, that's right. It's Saturday before Halloween. Is that the twenty seventh? That, um, by the way, I know we're, we're jumping way ahead here, but I'm going to urge Kenny just as soon as this dance is over to go ahead and print tickets because I already have orders for October's dance. If you did, if you send me the band and everything today, I have posters made we can hang up. Great. Sorry. Right yeah. directly. Direct. Oh, yeah. If you want to just, well, I'll write it down for you before you leave and you can look it up online. Uh, hey, Kenny, don't forget to put where the proceeds are going okay. on that poster. The website. It's easy enough. We have, if there's any chance that anything like that will be ready during the dance, we can have the rotary people take them off to the other part of the district. I do want to reiterate one thing. It is critical that we do not, do not mention the word fee for Johnny White. There's the check. Okay. He is owned by the ABC or whoever it is, ABC, NBC. He's under contract not be paid for a singing performance. So this has to be a contribution. A contribution. It could be a, be a, a donation contribution. Correct. For travel expenses. For travel expenses. Okay. So it's going to be a of your problem just to make sure you don't trip on it. Yeah. Oops. I didn't mean to say that. Bring that back up. Ah. Yeah, they had the day before and had to school the other day. They? they did at H camp. Yeah. They sure did. Yeah. 
Okay, that's all I got. All right. We'll see everybody at what time? Five thirty. Five thirty at the mill. Some of us earlier. Yeah, yes. and then what time in the morning? Nine. Nine. Nine, Nine o'clock. Yeah. I I asked Parker if we could set up Friday night. He said no. They have a long lunch and on Friday. It just won't. It won't work. So, what is what is? Okay. There has been a time where we had to be careful about making noise, but that's when we set up on a Friday because there were people working downstairs. Right. No, so we bring our rollerblades this time. Right. I think the, uh, the, top, the vitality may be open on Saturday. We may have until noon or something like that. We may have, but we normally work. Tables are set up beforehand. They'll set us up Friday night. Okay. 25 tables in the room. We'll adjust as we get there. Did you get insurance yet, you said? Yeah, yes, insurance I was purchased last here. night by Robert McKellen. Via long distance, got it. it's sent to Glenn. Yep, got it here. We actually saved some money over last year. So. <clears throat> One thing about not having a full house is your insurance doesn't cost you as much as the mm -hmm. charge per head. Okay. How many tables did we have last uh, dance? 31. 31. So there'll be more room. A third more. Yes, we're pushing the floor, we're pushing the floor out. The band's going to be dead center of the back wall there. Oh, okay. And we'll more dance room. And what okay. time are you going to be there to unload food Saturday? Well, I, I know I said be there five, by 5.30, five, 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 five. but well, you might five, want to be there a little bit earlier yeah. than 5.30. Yeah, well, food, there were some people. The food crew will be there at 5 to help you unload. Yeah, I, I need some people there about 5 probably yeah. to start to unload food. We need to make sure you bring some coolers, too, from the kitchen, you know, some big angle coolers. We've got to have a way to keep the food warm. Once it gets cold, we'll not have a way to be heated. Well, we're going to have chafing dishes, right? Yes, yeah. but it's not enough for the holding. Oh, for the holding. Yes. Well, don't they have those heating boxes? Uh, John does it now that we can carry. His stuff's too big. He's got these big rolling units. So well, what we have to be careful the, because it's prepared so food. It's only allowed to sit out so long right. before it becomes an issue where we have to reheat it. So well, we've, we've had kept it warm before. How do we do that? I think we had those, more, think about those brown cabinets. Yeah. Yeah. I think this may have come from the soup kitchen. They did. Okay. That big we rolling need, unit, yes. Gee, would you make, you're making yeah, notes for the I'm soup kitchen. Down. Thank you. Is Austin going to be there today? <clears throat> you don't think so? He's sick. Uh, He's sick. He, yeah. Yeah. He, he told me yesterday, we talked, he said I'll be at a meeting in the morning, so apparently he's pretty sick. That's what they told me on yesterday. It's pretty bad. <coughs> Full-blown case. Anything else? Flu? No, he does have the flu. That's what they told me yesterday. <laughs> well, I don't need to be around it. <laughs> the critical thing is just making sure the food's ready for the folks when they come in. Anything else? I think we're good. Today's today's meeting is, is a focus on the dance, so anything else about the dance? Well, no, but the joy prom. The joy prom. Jen is working today on assigning school students to that program. Yes. Okay. And she, I don't know, does anybody see her emails when she writes me? No. no. Okay. She wanted to cast her vote in favor of plussing up the, the contributions for the joy prom to the 500 that was passed as a recommendation. So just we have one more yes vote. For the finance committee to consider. I think it's already carried then. Yeah, so already. Yeah, and I, I, I certainly will vote yes on it. Yeah. We, we, we didn't do we didn't do the no, formal we, request. We passed it over to the so yeah, it, it was, was a okay. formal request last week and yeah. alternates. Okay. We're supposed to have met on that. Okay. Yeah. All right. We'll have they met? So <laughs> well, I think we all. I know I cast my vote last. Uh, we, general we, acclimation. We had agreement on that. Yeah. Yeah. General um, acclimation. Yeah. You might want to make it formal, Mr. President. All right, so we've had a request for $500 for the joy prompt. The difference. The, we've, we've got some cash in hand. The he difference. Did, he didn't know that. Yeah, I'm not. That's what I'm people threw in money. Yeah, right. we have like 100, 120 bucks. So, so, we, have a, so we have a request to, to provide funds to bring the total up to $500. The uh, the request has been made. the the uh, The committee <coughs> with a couple of standards has has reviewed this and brings their recommendation for us to approve this uh, this fund. Not needing a second because it comes from them. The floor is open for discussion. 
sorry, fund for what? For the joy prom. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Would we move, have a motion that we accept? Yeah, it, it comes, it's, it's right on the table. table. It's on the table now that we're going to provide the discussion about that issue. The committee brought it forward for action. I'll call the question. We can Very good. Then we'll call the question. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Okay. Good. So when do we know how much we've what, what am I writing a check for? How much? Well, do we know how much we collected in cash last week? I think it was $120. Yeah. Okay, so it'd be well, 380 I had 180 180? cash, but that was for, I need to make sure I know what that was for. So that was Joy Prom? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So it was 180 Donald said he paid 20 Somebody else didn't have it. We threw it in. There, there may be more coming, so but let's eight. assume the club's going to write 380 so I need to write a check for 380 to Joy Prom. Right. Is that yeah. what I'm hearing? Right. For, for 500, 500, 500 and deposit all cash. All right. It goes, yeah, that's right, 500, 500 now. And it, it goes, goes I think it's made out to the Discovery stuff. Church. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yes. Last year it was Discovery Church. Right, it's it's same same group. Group. same group. Same group. $500. And anybody that didn't participate last week that wants to this week, just uh, put a little something in uh, Glenn's palm over there on your way out this morning. Okay, anything else before we adjourn? Yes, I have one other item. Ha, follow Here, Dan. On. It, this has been, I've had to put up with this the entire meeting. All right, well, Michael, would you stand? He has complained the whole time, and we couldn't hear what was going on. But go ahead and stand and give your case. <clears throat> before we leave, I, said, uh, I asked the person to do something nice. And then they sent out an email and said, send this picture out. And then they said something about Dr. Wimberly's secretary. But that's okay. But they misspelled my name. Oh, oh. Hey. oh. It must be an inexperienced oh. secretary. Yeah. Okay. They, they misspelled my name. And I'm not going to call him name, but I'll give you the initials. Ken. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, there's no R at the end of my between the L and the, and the Y. If, if you need a new secretary, <laughs> <laughs> the job's open. <laughs> secretary stays open. Anything else then? I'm all right now. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay uh, Rick. Rick is going to go over today and give. Uh, you got to spell that. The camp corral check today. If anybody would like to go to a two o'clock, two o'clock, Golden Corral, at Golden Corral. And do, do we know the manager's name? Jim yeah, Hildebrand. Jim, Jim, uh, Hildebrand. Jim Hildebrand. Jim Hildebrand. Jim, yeah. you know the manager's name? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I know it. I know it quite well. <laughs> or maybe James. I, don't know. I think in the in the well, band days we knew him as he, James. He goes by Jim on the, on his name tag. Okay. We try to get a photo up if we can. Right, uh, Austin. Okay, I'm going to get together with Austin this morning. Uh, I've just, just shared some text back and forth with Austin to talk about the warming cabinets, the chafing dishes, uh, or and or coolers to keep stuff warm. Sternos. Sternos for the chafing dishes. Yeah, chafing dishes and sternos. Anything else you all think of? Yeah, did you leave the caverns intact? We left the caverns intact. Okay. Good. Carlsbad caverns are amazing. Sir, we just had some okay. gloves right there. With the servers. Okay. Because I did this last night. I was going through it. Warmer if they have it, and garbage cans and trash bags. That's what I have. I'll, I'll just, he just said he was headed over to the soup kitchen soon, so. John wants to be a Rotarian, but he, he told Richard and I he doesn't want to make the meetings. Can he become a Rotarian uh, for his efforts for the dance? If he will use Correct. the if he will use the camera, he will be a fully qualified member of the club. There we go. Okay. Or the option would be to make him honorary. No, can't collect dues from an honorary member. <laughs> and we need the head. Frankly, guys, we need the head count. We need the head count. We pull those bodies off. We're down four. Yeah, the president's not going to have a stellar, a stellar uh, year. That's okay. That's all right. We're going to leave. I'm, the club's going to be in great shape as, as Donald moves in, and he can spring forward, no problem. Hearing no other business, then.
the faint thing we can say or do, is it the truth? Is it fair to all concerned? Will it build goodwill and better friendships? Will it be beneficial to all concerned?